Well, good afternoon, and it is afternoon. It's 12.55 in the afternoon on uh, January the 5th, 2016. I'm heading down to, um, heading down to La Jolla Cove here, just for the heck of it. I'm going to try something a little different today. Yeah, kind of rough. It's, um, it's coming down pretty good. It's supposed to even get worse tomorrow, so we don't know exactly what's, what, uh, what the conditions are going to be out there on the beach, but, um, uh, this is looking kind of cool. Anxious to see what it's going to be like over there. Um, we're supposed to have flooding conditions along the coast this week because of the, well, basically because of the high tides and the high surf and the, and, and the storm that's coming in. We've got two of them back to back coming in on us. So it should be kind of exciting. Um, trying to see if you can see a little bit of them coastline there. I haven't, haven't had this this beach for a while. Uh, I got a feeling I'll be pretty pretty much on my own today. Ah, yeah. Not this way. Because this tide is kind of right up here. So I brought my waders and I brought my raincoat. And I'll be getting out there and, and getting wet this morning or this afternoon. Yeah, it's uh, it's rolling up here pretty high, and it really is, should be low tide right about now. So yeah, and a lot of surfers out there. So we'll see what happens. I'll uh, I'll suit up and I'll get back to you when I find, when I when I get down to the beach. For better or for worse, we are on the beach. This is going to be a good one. I'm probably going to get the Lens all crapped up, the water. Um, this is what she looks like. Yeah, I hate to see that because I'm afraid it's going to get all wet. But the, got the water kind of coming up my back right now. And I got to put the hood on here very shortly. So, I'll start hunting. Looks like it kind of drops off there a little bit. Look at the size of those damn waves, man. This is a, this is a biggie. And it is coming down pretty good. So, um, I'll get back to you when I find something. Okay, first target of the day. Now, my, the problem is, is that I'm not going to be able to show you a whole hell of a lot of sounds perch because it's uh, I got my hood on, and it's just kind of a pain in the ass to take my hood off just to get the to get, give give it the sounds. That that does sound pretty good, and we'll see what it is. And first target right out of the bat is looks like a dime. Yep, it's a crusty old dime. Right in there. What do we got? I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm not gonna spend a whole hell of a lot of time covering up holes today because it's just raining so much, so much that it's just going to cover them back up pretty quick anyway. That's a penny. Okay, well, I hope you can see that. hope you can see that through the uh, wet lens. First quarter of the day. Look at my hands. They're pruning. <laughs> anyway. Nah. Looking pretty bleak out there, guys. <laughs> God, I hope you guys can see this. Anyway, for now. Wow. Right 
up out of there. That was just damn hard to find. That's a little chunk of silver. A little tiny toe ring. One of those wrap around toe rings. I hope we don't break it in the process of doing this. But that's a little ring in the scoop, guys. I claim that. Ring in the scoop. I'll take it. Nice. Little silver number. Like I said, I hope you can see this stuff. Anyway, I'm taking it. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Okay, on, onward. Okay, so there's a few of you out there who will recognize what this is. Those of you who don't, that, my friends, is a standing Liberty Quarter. That's Silva. That's just very cool. <laughs> yeah, we have some beach conditions, but I'll tell you what. Wow, pretty nifty. I'll take it. It is really, really nasty out here. I'm down at a in a, into a clay bank here that is kind of... Things are kind of sitting on top of them, I reckon. Anyway, I'll get back to you. second one I found today. <laughs> I'll tell you what, this is about the best damn digging I've had out here ever. This is just fantastic, man. Look at that. That's buff, dude. <laughs> I mean, I got all kinds of good stuff in the pouch. I can't wait to show you when I get back. So this is a lot of clay. I'm digging into the clay right now. It's just really, really soft. So whatever the hell is in here, it's probably been in here for a while. Ah. Okay, look at that. That's really good. Then the scoop. Now here's the problem with this. <laughs> it does not rinse out of the scoop. there. Right there. No. Right there. What the hell? Okay, now I think I've got it. I'm sure I 
Eu? Yeah, that's kind of cool. That went through the scoop. Through the hole through the scoop the first time. That's got to be one ancient damn fishing solo. Look at that thing. That's been around for a while. You just kind of don't make them like that anymore. <laughs> That's pretty cool, man. Okay, I'll take it. What do we got? We got ourselves a dime. And it is a Hey, another Merc. Cool. I like it. I'll take it. Okay, so this is the last last shot of the day. That's kind of pretty, I think. Rather nice. Yeah, man. So been a pretty darn good day. Didn't find any gold, but I did find some silver. So, uh, yeah, I'll show it to you guys at the wrap-up. So, just stand by, like the man said. Yeah, nice. Okay. <laughs> okay, we got a wrap-up for a... Uh, Tuesday, it's January the 5th. Good, um, it's a pretty darn good hunt today. I was really, really, really surprised. Rugged as hell and rained like crazy out there. A couple of times I couldn't even hear myself think out there. It was so, it was raining so hard. But, um, uh, and I, and, uh, I'm, I'm hoping that, um, uh, hoping I got some, some good videos of that. I haven't put the video together yet. But anyways, this is the, um, this is the trash for the day. It was probably more than this, but this is um, just a good represent rep representation. Uh, and uh, some kind of a knife, or part of a knife and spoon. This is um, stuff that was uh, been out there for a little while. Yeah, just the usual basic junk. I don't see anything special here. There's something in here that was ringing good. I might break that open later on. And this has got some kind of ch a little wiry chain thing to it or something. I don't really know what the hell that is either. It actually could be bling, some kind of bling. I don't know. Anyway, that's the junk. The junk is the junk. And <clears throat> oddities, kind of a pretty good pile of oddities. Uh, very old pair of sunglasses. This was down about down about eight inches. The way it was rang like crazy, but uh, so it's it's been there for a little while. It fairly dated. Um, this is lead. Somebody made a big ass sinker out of, out of, a, out of a piece of sheet lead. And this is lead. And I don't know exactly what the hell this thing is. I'm not really sure. And I think, as I recall, I think Max said that these are weights for a, a net, for a fishing net. Again, I'm not really sure about that either. But it's also lead. And then I got this little, little, um, it's a little, it's a little buckle for a uh, for a swim cap. And that's probably 40s in that area. And this little lever thing, this is made out of brass. Don't know what the hell it is. Some kind of a little thumb lever. Kind of cool looking thing. A little wheel. And this is this this is a mystery. I don't know what it's made out of. It didn't stick to my magnet, so it's undoubtedly uh, non-ferrous. What the hell is that thing? It's just that's just intriguing. Maybe somebody can shed some light on that. I think this is a bullet. Yeah, I'm almost positive it is. A long ass bullet. A little piece of copper rivet. This was probably from a wood planking on a boat or something somewhere along the line. That would be my guess. Um I got this fishing this fishing this fishing swivel. This is really, really old. I mean talk about a vintage swivel swivel. I think it's made out of brass. Pretty cool. Um, lipstick tube. Couldn't find the outside to it. There is lipstick in it. 
kind of gross looking. But um, yeah, that that thing rang up pretty good too. Anyway, pretty good little pile of oddities. I mean, yeah, hell, you could even, you could even call them some of those things um, um, relics. You know, they're just they're just uh, little little neat things for uh, treasures. That's it in plaid. <clears throat> it's one quarter, two nickels, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven dimes is a half, half a dozen pennies there, and I think this is a penny. Not sure. Uh, I, I can't read it. It's just got. It's just looking. It's just looking pretty bad. I have no idea what the hell it is. Let's see if I can see it in the light. It almost looks like it's got a pattern on it, but I can't make it out. If I try to, if I look at it too close, it just. It just loses all detail. I don't know. Very thin. Fairly heavy. But, but I'm, I'm thinking penny, but you know, but uh, but but I'm also I'm I'm thinking I see some kind of some kind of pattern on there or something. I don't know. I don't know. And then for the really good stuff I got today, check this out, man. Here's to show you what happens when you when you when you when you hunt on the beach. It's kind of it's, that's your that's kind of eroded. That's a standing liberty, silver standing liberty. Can't find a date on it. Two Mercuries. That one is a 1941. That one I can't find a date on. Uh, two uh, two Buffalo nickels. They're, 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 these are these are kind of neat. This is a 1936. And I can't tell the date on this one. This one's in pretty good shape. Kind of a neat, kind of a neat, a neat piece there. And then this nice little silver toe ring. And it is really pretty. It's very, very nice. Shined up really nicely. And um, that will go in my, go in my little silver, in my little silver treasure box. But yeah. Pretty good. So, that's about it for the day, folks. I don't have nothing else to show you, but I'm 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 very happy with this hunt today. I, I'm uh, I'm quite chuffed. So, everybody have a good day. Be safe out there. Happy hunting, and thanks again for watching. <laughs>